So Michael Quander is live at DC Police Headquarters in Northwest. So Michael, what can you tell us? Well, Reese, detectives will have their hands full this morning after that violent weekend because at last check, those bad guys responsible for all these shootings are still out there on the streets. Crime is everywhere. Beyond the flashing lights and crime tape in Ivy City is D.C.'s latest homicide investigation. It's a triple shooting that happened Sunday on Oakey Street in Northeast. Police say one person died and two others were hurt. That's pitiful. It comes on the heels of another triple shooting in Northwest Saturday night. Police say 17-year-old Wilfredo Torres and 16-year-old Jamie Zalea were killed and a woman was hurt. That shooting happened on 13th Street, just one block away from the 4th District police station on Georgia Avenue. It appears to be a targeted shooting. Uh, we do not have a motive at this time. Uh, we're very uh, concerned. I know the police are going to be aggressively investigating. In the span of just 11 hours from Saturday to Sunday, D.C. police say eight people were shot in six different shootings across the city. Several of those shootings happened within minutes of each other. Wow, this is, this is this is too much. People we spoke with called the crime ridiculous and say they want something done about it right away. You know, it's, it's, it's going on. It's everywhere. It's all over D.C. You know, what can we do? Yeah, this is all happening far too often, according to those people we talked to. Now, we did some digging and found out that there have been a total of 26 homicides so far this year. That's compared to 22 killings at this same time last year. Now, if you know anything about these latest shootings, please make sure to get them a call right away. That number is 202-727-9099. And remember, you guys, you can report anonymously. All right, thank you very much, Michael. And as you mentioned, we're reporting on this far too often. 